super loose shifter. You can hear it too. If you hear that metal clanking noise, that means your bushings are gone. And these are the bushings that we have to replace, both of them. Alright, so I took out the linkage. I'm going to be washing it. And this one actually took out from the transmission. It's pretty simple. It's just 10 millimeter bolt and nut on the one side. Take both out in the washer and this pops out. Okay. And now I can easily install the new bushing. Alright, so clean this area up. Lubricated the new bushing and I'll be trying to install it. I don't have the installation tool, but it is what it is. I gotta improvise. One eternity later. All right, so I finally pressed this bushing in, but I'm not gonna lie, it was a pain even outside of the car to do this. It's crazy. I'm not, I have no idea how I'm gonna be doing the other one. But uh, long story short, here's, here's what it looks like. I damaged it just a little bit right there. Yeah, but it's all in here, all intact. So that will get installed. And now it's going to be the biggest headache to do that one that's on the shifter itself. And yeah, I remember even when I had the um, um, actual like press tool kit for the for these specific bushings even then that thing wasn't really working because when you squeeze this thing together it just kind of like it just makes this thing blown up but it's not really going through the the actual linkage through the bracket you know it just kind of like blows this thing up you know so even the transmission shifter installation tool like it's not it's not the best it doesn't always work and this one was a pain. Unfortunately, I couldn't do any other thing but just using this kind of combination right here to press this thing in. And uh, otherwise, this thing would not go. It was a pain. So yeah, even if you had the press tool, it would have been uh, hard. So you probably have to use something like this. So just slowly. I'll show you later once I take this assembly apart what I used. All right, so this is what the bushing looks like. It's not the best, but I was able to press it in and everything. So I'm gonna reinstall the shifter right now. I'm gonna put some lube there, reinstall the shifter uh, linkage and uh, the clip should be good. We'll retest the shifter. All right, clip is reinstalled and both of this bushing and also, sorry, it's really tight here, but that bushing also installed. Okay, so that one and also I replaced this vacuum hose right here while I was here. It's still a brand new one. So yeah, that's amazing. Both of them are replaced. Good to go. This is how I was pressing the bushing in. So the bushing was where my index finger is right now. And then I had a nut uh, on the other end and I was just literally like tightening the nut and bolt together. And yeah, eventually the bushing went in.